Hi guys, welcome to another episode and uh, this episode will be about the safety features of the Model X Falcon Wing Doors. Uh, not a lot of people know these things, but uh, there are actually some pretty high-tech stuff in, built into these uh, doors for safety. So first of all, I want to bring to your attention that uh, there are pinch sensors um, all along the edge. So everything that you see here, this thing here, this this thing that looks like a this thing that looks like a bead, is uh, what they call a pinch sensor. So if I were to touch it, you may be able to hear it. It makes this clicking noise when I press it. You should be able to hear it. So that's to prevent your fingers from being pinched. So it comes it, it, on the front of the falcon wing door. It's all the way from here, all the way down there to the top of that hinge right there. And on the other side, uh, we obviously do not have it here, but we do have it all along that side, like that. So. To the rear of the falcon wing door, we have the bead that runs all the way across like this. So what I could do is, I'll bring it down, and then I will touch it. And this is basically the strip right here, all along that side. And the other thing that uh, you may not be aware of is, there's actually two more sensors. So there's a sensor supposed to be in here, right above the, the hinge. So it's supposed to detect objects inside the car. So this is the thing that is malfunctioning uh, for my car and for many other cars. And uh, similarly, you have another set of uh, sensors that are in here. So it's right above the hinges. And when it's coming down, uh, it's supposed to detect objects. So the last piece is actually this trim here, which is on the outside of the uh, Falcon Wing door. This trim here is supposed to be uh, a something like your. Uh, it, it's it, this trim here is supposed to be a capacitive uh, sensor. So uh, it's sensitive to touch. Similar to like what you have on your iPad or any of your touch phones and stuff like that. So uh, when you open the door and you press it or touch come in contact with this, it will stop instantly. So let me uh, close this and I'll show you. So when I open it, by pressing here and then I come into contact with this strip it will stop so what I want to do is also test with a carrot <laughs> what happens when I close the door like this so hopefully this will hit it and it will stop, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, try the rear one first, which will be right here. And uh, I'm gonna press the, go the close and put the simulation finger here. Oh, look at that. N no damage whatsoever. So I think if I put my finger there, it will actually stop. So I didn't feel any pinch on this thing here. So let's give it a try for the for the love of science. I will put my I will put my own finger there so that the, um, it will stop the the door. Okay. So let's open this up again. S stop it right by touching it. And then I'm going to put my finger 
here like this and let's see what happens okay if my finger gets chopped off uh, <laughs> uh, you will uh, see it in the news I guess so here we go ouch it did pinch a little bit but it did stop so the force is not that great um, and I do not have a bruise or anything if you look at my finger there's nothing there uh, we can try it one more time open and capacitive touch to stop it we will try it down here like this and we'll close it again let's see what happens <gasps> my finger ouch it's a pinch but it did not cut off my finger okay so the next time I'm gonna put it up here so I've tried it down here it hurts a little bit more up here not so much I'm assuming that up here it will not hurt at all so one last time for the love of science I just stopped it now let's see my finger <gasps> ouch ouch that hurt <laughs> Uh, yeah, but it did stop and my finger did not get chopped off. So that's the important part. Um, what we can do is try uh, the pinch sensors on this side. So we're going to open it again. Touch that so that it won't. Bring out my, my finger simulator again. And uh, we will try it. I need a tripod. Uh, in order to do this, but let, let me try it again. Let's open it all the way. I'm gonna touch the thing right here, and then I'm gonna leave the. Okay, so it did stop, and uh, yeah, there's not, mm, there's no damage to the carrot, so, and it did hit the sensor so I'm gonna try my finger now but I think I'll, I'll preemptively um, touch the sensor probably so it's gonna open again we're gonna close it and here goes my finger Oh, okay. Yeah, so, yeah, as long as you touch this sense. I was uh, a little bit afraid, but, uh, yeah, once this sensor gets touched, it stops. So, let's try one more time. This time, I won't be so scared. Touch it to stop. And then uh, press this button. And then come back here, and I'll put my finger again. Yeah, so, it's more like a shock than anything it didn't hurt at all it, it certainly didn't hurt as much as when I had it in the back so again this is a pretty amazing technology um, the only issue is uh, these things are not working very well so what I could do is I will show you what happens uh, when it's coming down I will put my hand there and it should stop it and it would get the object detection like like I normally do. So we're going to touch this and then put when it's coming down when I touch this. Yeah, so when I touch that it should stop it. So there goes one and uh, we will try the one on this side. On the front side, like right here. So I'm going to touch the close button right here one back here put my hand there tap 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 and then there it goes so anyway um, I'm losing some light here but just to reiterate we have the sensors in the front which is this capacitive strip uh, only works when it's um, when it's going up by the way 
if it's coming down I can show you that it doesn't do anything so let me just uh, do that d demonstration so it's coming down I'm touching this I'm touching it I'm touching it I'm touching it I'm touching it I'm touching the inside nothing it just stops so <laughs> let me try to get so when you open it and you touch the outside of it it stops so let me open it all the way and then when it's coming down and I'm touching this whole piece even underneath it doesn't do anything so again just to reiterate we have uh, pinch sensors that are all the way from that top all the way to the bottom on the front side and then we have the capacitive sensor on the, on the bottom which uh, uh, actually stops from opening when it touches something on closing it doesn't do anything so that's turned off on the back here of the falcon wing door we have the capacitive sensor uh, not, not, I'm sorry the the pinch sensor that's uh, all the way from from here all the way up uh, to here so and then we have those uh, uh, um, sensors uh, on the right above the pillars that uh, actually come down so um, what else um, the front doors also have the have the pinch sensors so they're right here all the way on the bottom uh, you know all along the, the side and uh, we'll do that uh, digit test again and I'll put it here and uh, I'll close it close ouch that is not good <laughs> <laughs> that is not good. So that is not good. Um, if you have your finger here, it will be chopped off. My poor carrot. It did not stop. Um, but it does stop if I'm like somewhere over here and I touch it so I can do the shove and then touch this it will stop but by the time it gets here I think it has too much force and uh, this is what happened to your finger if you put it here unfortunately uh, it did not stop uh, I'll try it one more time with the thicker part like maybe here uh, and then uh, we'll, we'll stop, okay. Uh, door open. And pull the clothes. And we'll put it here. Ah! My finger! Jesus Christ! There's no way I'm putting my finger there. That is not cool. The front... Big goes the half of my other finger. Ay ay ay. It's down there. Oh boy. No way I'm putting my finger there. Uh, so anyway, that concludes the test. Uh, front uh, is uh, not very safe. The Falcon Wing doors, pretty safe. Uh, I put my finger there and there was no issue on both sides. Uh, this sensor is not as sensitive um, so it will probably hurt your finger pretty bad and this is the example so thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos